Hi there, I'm St. Peter, and welcome to Christianity TV. Today, I bring you two special guests. St. Paul and St. Ananias. Welcome. Thanks, Peter. Thanks, Peter. Great Thanks. to be on the show. St. Paul, where were you from? I was from a relatively small village in Turkey called Tyrus. Why did you hate Christians so much? I hated Christians because I believed that they were insulting God by preaching the words of a false and untruthful man who came from nowhere, claiming he was the son of God. What did you see when you got blinded on the road to Damascus? I saw an extremely blinding light and a faint figure of Jesus. What did the vision change about you? The vision changed a lot in what I believe in and my generosity as a person. I now truly believe that Jesus was the Son of God and that he was still with us. Are you grateful for St. Ananias unblinding you and accepting you into the Christian community? Yes, I am very grateful because I had sinned against him, God and the rest of the Christian community. Despite all the trauma I caused, St. Ananias still forgave me. I was most grateful because I would not have done that. Were you at the stoning of St. Stephen? Yes, I was at the stoning of St. Stephen. Why were you at it? I'm not quite sure why I was there, but heard Stephen preaching, and at the time, hating Christians, and knowledge that people could stone Christians, I started throwing rocks and people joined. Did you expect to be accepted into the Christian community? No, I did not expect the Christian community to welcome me. Why? Why did you feel the need to go on all your missionary journeys? Because I needed to show the Christian community I had changed my ways and that I needed to give back for what I had done. So St. Ananias, where were you from? I am from Damascus, Syria. Why did you follow Jesus? I followed Jesus because I strongly believed in his teachings and I wanted to be one of the few who spread Christianity around the world and supported everyone's religion. What did you do for the Christian community? I thought I made a significant impact on the Christian community where I spread the good news and beliefs of Jesus. Were you scared when the Jewish authorities and the Romans were coming after the Christians? Yes, I was very scared, not only for myself, but for the other innocent Christians for whom they did nothing wrong. Why did you unblind St Paul? I unblinded St Paul because I received a message from Jesus who told me to forgive. Why would people consider you a significant Christian? I think I get considered a significant Christian because I was a disciple and was one of the few people who spread the Christianity community all around the world.